Welcome to the Metal Command Podcast, everybody. I have a guest on my show. I have Brett from the show Metal Mastication, which I think is a really, really cool show and, and a really cool concept, basically getting heavy metal musicians in the kitchen to make some of their favorite food and something very unique I've never seen in the scene before. So it's really, I'm really glad to have you here. Right on. Thank you, man. It's a pleasure to be here. Uh, thank, thank you. So let's talk about this, man metal musicians heavy metal musicians in the kitchen I, th I think that's as someone that's spent 20 years of my life in the food industry you know you know it seems like a long time ago now but i thought it was fascinating to get these guys in in the kitchen to make like their favorite thing and some of the conversations are pretty funny so let's talk about your show what is the show about and how did you come up with the idea to do this um well i i okay so i know how to cook um, I grew up in the kitchen. My dad was a gourmet cook, mm -hmm. uh, cooking since I could see above the counter. I actually worked my way up in a restaurant, blah, blah, blah. I was a yeah. sous chef uh, for a while there in high school, actually. Uh, the only five-star restaurant in Melbourne Beach, Florida at the time. Mm -hmm. uh, anyway, so I'm following Billy Sheehan on Facebook. And Billy is the hardest working musician, I think, out there today. And he still takes a couple hours a day to respond to his fans on social media. Sure. And everyone, of course, is asking him musical questions, right? You know, his gear, his tone, how do you do this? How do you do that? And whenever he's home from tour, he cooks. And so he was posting these cooking videos. And so one night I just responded with a cooking question and he's like, well, I do it this way. How did you know? And I'm like, well, I know how to cook. And then, so we just started talking right about cooking. And one night as, as I often do, I'm sitting here daydreaming, you know, thinking, God, wouldn't it just be fucking cool as hell to hang out in the kitchen, kitchen with Billy Sheehan making his famous pasta sauce that he posts all the time. Our wives can be sitting over there drinking some good vino, you know, and we're just sitting in the kitchen shooting the shit. Yeah, I'm like, correct. Be so, right? I mean, come on, that'd be so fucking cool. I also happened to write for Heart of Hollywood magazine covering the metal scene. Okay. And in that capacity... I met Giles Lavery, a current lead vocalist and Warlord. He's also a manager of uh, Lillian Axe and Warlord and, and I, some other bands. And he was coming. He lives in Germany. He's coming to California. He's working on a documentary. And he says, hey, Brett, do you want to interview uh, Mark Zonder and I for the upcoming Warlord album in Mark Zonder's home studio? Mm-hmm. I'm like, nah, I'm busy, dude. Of course, right? And so he, yeah, I go, yeah, call me back. So he calls me back with the date and the time. And, and at that time, he says, how would you like to interview Impelitary? And I'm like, I'm sorry, Chris Impelitary? Mm -hmm. And he goes, yeah, and his bass player. I'm like, fuck yeah, I do. And so we set that up. And that was at the bass player's house, James Pulley. And I walk in there for that interview and James's wife is cooking Giles some eggs. And I walk past and all I say under my breath is, wow, that's fucking perfect. And Pulley heard me and said, perfect for what? And I'm like, oh, fuck, you heard that? Okay, so I told him the idea of the show and he was in love with it right away. He loved the name, he loved the concept. This guy makes lasagna every year for Thanksgiving and passes them out like gift cards. And so he's like, let's do it, let's do it. And so we did the first episode in his kitchen, and there you go. 